on the tree. So guys, today I have a taste of something else. So that's why I'm wearing a dress right now of my very very old dress. This is so hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. So my name is Tenzin Yerwanga and I'm 11 years old. So guys, you know like we're going through an eye flu right now. So it's like very much healed right now. It doesn't hurt. Like there's no eye poop anymore and like the red is almost healed. Like look, only, only a like stripe is there. My mom like is like already healed but she has like a little bit like a little bit like the Y like a little bit okay like a little bit in the bottom of her eye so that's why like like mom is positive that she'll go at Monday at school she'll she'll like be healed healed at Monday she's sure that tomorrow that her eyes will heal and she's going to school and but we don't know yet we don't know how to protect the future yeah so today's food is rice with today's food is rice rice with beetroot we also have alu and there is meat in there and it smells delicious yes and also there's nothing else and there's also onions onions tomatoes tomatoes onions beetroot and rice and aloo and potatoes well yeah beetroot is actually a legacy in our family <laughs> it's like we almost eat beetroot every day like yeah mom says beetroot is very healthy for us that's why she makes us eat them a lot us mean only me okay <laughs> so as you guys can see today i'm wearing a dress which is very unusual because i usually wear a shirt or a short pan like yeah i usually don't wear dresses but this is actually a very old dress these this this dress used to be my favorite when i was very little yeah i i used to wear this dress every day like it has a meaning because all of my dress is like oval shape but only this one is like you can do this <laughs> i love this dress that's why so we also have a salad here today of course so we so we also have a salad here today okay of course it has to be with beetroot yes there is black pepper on top and there is the main course of salad cucumbers yes and gigantic limbus limes yeah uh our cousin jomela gave us these big gigantic limbo and there is like not only one like like a like a, a full a full bag of those yeah it's very delicious yes it's good juicy and it's very good for your health yeah <laughs> thank you so next we have soup Hot and sour soup, right from the package. So delicious. Smell it. Beautiful. Hot and sour soup. Okay. Enjoy. And what? And last but not least, the most important dish. Sauce. I put like sauce every day in my food. Mom's favorite dish is this. She can't live without it. Like she dies if she doesn't eat, eat spice. Yeah, she needs spice in her life. Like it's like the main course. Like we need our heart to live. She needs spice to live. I need tomato to live. Yeah, so enjoy watching us eat. sauce this is the favorite meal of my day lunch at dinner like i eat too much and then at like at the night i like feel so hungry even though i eat so much and sometimes at dinner when i eat too much my stomach my stomach cooks so much that i can't even sleep at night so 
and at breakfast i can't even eat like my tummy still hurts and like yeah mm, i don't have the mood to eat at breakfast and like i have to eat like a whole bowl yeah Whole bowl for this much. No, no, whole bowl for this much. No, at breakfast I like see like that. There's so much food in my plate. Eat. So yeah. That's why lunch is actually the favorite meal of my day. Like. I eat the right amount at lunch. Don't know why, but I guess I was born like this. Lunch, like when I eat lunch, whatever I eat is so tasty. Don't know. Oh, lemon. Mmm. This is so good. This is not lemon. Lemon. If you are watching. Thank you. Who is Jujun? Jujun Mila. He lives in Red DC. He has two kids. Huh? Yeah. He has two children. Uh, one is a boy, one is a girl. The boy is actually in 8th grade. The girl is in 6th. Right? In 6th. She's the same. Boy right? right. is in 9th grade. No, no. Thank you. 8 or 9, I think. Yeah. I don't know. I, I met the group, but I didn't really talk much. No, who is Chumela then? Who is Chumela? Mm. Chumela is, oh, you know my sumo, my mother's uh, uh, younger sister, my sumo, younger sister, sumo is uh, her husband's brother is Chumela. This is very confusing for myself too. So yeah. When we first came here, Jamala helped us a lot, like moving the stuffs, even invited us for dinner. That's the day when I met his two kids. They have a beautiful house. Like, in our school, there's two parts. Like, one is for college. After, um, yeah, it's like college. Yeah. And uh, it's called VTC IDI International, something like that. I don't really remember. Sorry. And one part is already, you guys know that it's my school. So good. This is so good. Yeah. Like, once you get inside the gate, there are two parts. We don't really go here much at VTC because we're not allowed at school time. Because they have to do their own thing, college stuff, learn, do training. Wine. Yeah, they do training. Oh. Oh. oh, we like uploaded a video before of our school going to VTC. Six and seven grade going, uh, six, seven, eight, and seven going to VTC because they're like showing your challenge and something like that. And it was so cool. Like they did like baking, like did many stuff that time. And yeah, they learn those at BTC. Like, they learn how to do impressive things. <laughs> yeah, that's the word I was trying to find. Impressive. Hmm. <laughs> Hmm. 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 Mine is still so hot. Mine is so hot. Come back to the kitchen. Mine is hot. 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 Mine I'm actually starting to miss school because at school you get to see all your friends, talk, <laughs> at break you fight, and then sometimes you fight some more. Mm. 
I miss the fighting thing. Like, I'm the one who stops the, all the fights because I'm the monitor. There are three monitors. One is me, of course. There's Nira Wangya. Second is Kandro. Then Kandro. And third is Tepi. He's a boy. Yeah. Two girls and one boy. Yeah. Um, yeah, Kim and Tepi. Tepi and I are both from the same school. DC, upper DC. And Kandro is from DC, Maclot. Maclot DC school. Yeah. I'm a good gender. I'm a good manager. Like, there are so much fights going in our class every day. They do something like bullfight, and I, I get so irritated when they do the bullfight. Like, like, they like turn to this side and they start to fight like this. It's very funny, but I hate it. It's not good to fight like that. Yeah, it's not good to fight like that. That's why I'm stopping. They do not listen because they're boys. And some of the girls are like, yeah. And they're like starting to do their own thing and like betting like who's gonna win. Uh, I'm the, I'm always the one who's like so angry. I said, I'm going to tell the teacher. And there's one to be like, oh my God, don't ruin the fun. And I'm like, uh, yeah, 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 do your own thing. I'm just going to tell the teacher. And they all go quiet. And then I'm the boss. You <laughs> malu on the boss then. it's so boring not going to school like every day you wake up at seven you know every day you wake up have to wake up at six or six and a half and five and a half or something like that between five and six like we wake up and then we have to do all the you know things we do in the morning like you guys go to school right like first we have to wake up mm, like wash your face then eat your food breakfast and i told you guys that eating breakfast is so hard and like you have to quickly eat your breakfast and if it's not done it's okay like you just like mom i'm not going to eat and then you just take your backpack get ready wear your uniform get back go go to school and if you're late you're gonna have to take a punishment and that's done and then like you don't have to worry about that and then go to your first period and like things like here right now it's like you wake up so slowly like eh, where am i who am i what well, what is this like you're like there and then like uh, like eat and then after like you don't eat first you just like stay on your bed and just read a book or maybe just sleep some more and then you have nothing to do stare at a wall like yeah and then next you have to eat like eating is so slowly and right now there's time so you have to eat all the breakfast like if it if there's school like you don't have time so you just take some few bites and then you just go yeah right now there's a huge time like there's so like there's time time it's like time is waiting for you yeah so you gotta eat so slowly and then you have to eat it because like there's no excuse to make so you just have to eat <sighs> so then um, after eating then you have to just go back to bed read a book again or maybe just draw some things play jenga play lego and just eat something there's nothing eat fruits Eat fruits, yeah. Mom always gives me fruits, apples, bananas, oranges, and sindu. What sindu. do you call them? Pomegranate. Pomegranate, yeah. 
When I'm talking to you guys, I just forget all the words. Don't know why. That's called nervous. Mm -hmm. I'm not nervous. Am I nervous? Like, it's delicious, hot, sour, and double two eggs, no, three eggs, no, five eggs hot. All these things combined. But it's delicious too. Yeah. So, next you just have to like stay. Mom does her own business and then I do my own. Sometimes I just watch my TV, stay chill, don't do anything. And then after that, I help my mom do something. Sometimes she carries on, like, she takes advantage of my help and then lets me do all the housework. <laughs> so sad. Hmm. Hmm. You don't act learn. like you, you don't know. Learn. You have to learn how to cook. Oh. How to do the dishes. <laughs> how to clean the house. Maria. Yeah, I do dishes a lot. Dishes a lot, Mindula. No. Plan the 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 Yeah, I do that. I do that every day. But like uh not every day. Did you do this? Mm -hmm. My mother's cup is good night, look. Good night. And there's a cat. No, a wolf. And mine is wild. Wild leopard and wolf. Yeah. These cups are good. We bought it at Central Mall. Wild. We bought it. We bought. Mm. We bought it then. Hmm? Bought it. Yeah. We bought it then. Yeah, yeah. Because we bought it. I really want to go somewhere right now, like That's swimming. Something like that. No, I'm not allowed to go at quarantine. I want to go swimming so badly, or maybe at the mall, or maybe outside just it's to like... mall is like once in a blue moon like down there. What? What? Blue moon is up to like 3,000 years. No. When is blue moon? Very dear. Blue moon then. Right now? No. After 3,000 years? Three thousand no. years after three thousand years, you won't be existing. You won't. You won't hear. I won't be waiting till three thousand years to go to Central Mall just to go watch a movie. I really want to watch a movie right now. Since today was Sunday and yesterday was Saturday, that means like Saturday we have to chill. So. Me and my mom have been watching a movie in YouTube. Uh, mom wrote like Tibetan movies, Tibetan movies 2023, like that. And then, no, uh, Tibetan movies only. And there was like a man face, like a beard, pure, like white beard. And he was like, it was from China. No, Tibet or China, I don't know. I don't know, really know that. Uh, they were bald from like half of the head. And then like, he had like this. Uh, so yeah. Her hair hairstyle was everyone's hairstyle was except for the girls. The girls were so pretty, yeah. So, <laughs> except for the girls, like the boys were like the this half of the head was bold, and then like and then uh, till here like there was a little bit here and there was like a braid. Say a braid. Yeah. A braid, yeah. And like yeah, and yeah, the main character was. A doctor who who brings people to life yeah there was a man who's dying and he already like didn't breathe and then they went to that doctor and he told him to like show his tongue and then people showed his tongue and took paper like this and then whack, he like took a he he stabbed at that tongue blood yeah, like something like that. It. Yeah, and it hung, and then the paper got like bloody, and then when they removed the paper, like there was blood here, and then like he came back to life. How stupid is that? Like, it's so strange. 
it's stupidly strange. Oh my god, like, I don't even want to talk about that. Like, there was a man who was so poor and then he was so hungry. He was going through the streets and, like, was like looking at people eat, and then he was like, and then there was people who was like eating and then looking at him and then like turning and then like things like that. And then he was so hungry and at the ground there was meat. Raw meat. And there was a dog and that dog wasn't eating the meat. So he was just leaving it and like turning around playing on his own. So the poor man thought maybe I should just eat the raw meat. And he was like looking here, looking there, back. And then he took the meat, the raw meat from the ground, and he just ate it. Like, ah, rah, rah, rah. and there's a man, the dog's owner. The dog owner said, Oh my god, what are you doing? And there was like, What are you doing? You shouldn't do this. And then the dog's owner is actually someone, ah, like something like very mean, but very rich. Rich, a little bit of above, and rude. Mean. Yeah. And he was so ugly, yeah, ugly. And he was like, what are you doing? And he was like, uh, he called the servants and said like, ordered, ordered 10 pots of rice, 10 pots of rice. And it was the poor man's punishment to take the meat from his dog and saying like, and the poor man was like, your dog wasn't really eating the meat, so I just took it, like, I'm really hungry, so sorry. And then he thought that the man, like, the really mean man was doing it for good, like, ordering the 10 pots of rice for good. It was just to, like, like him, let him eat. And then he was like, thank you, sir, thank you, sir. And he was like, what kind of thank you? Mm, you have to eat it in front of me, all of the rice. And he was like, oh, okay, okay, okay. And then, like, after he was done with, like, seven or six pots, he was like, I can't eat anymore. <laughs> and then the doctor and everyone was surrounded. And, the, you know, the, uh, the rice cooker and, like, the shopkeeper. <laughs> like, uh, the shopkeeper. Like, um, the restaurant keeper, yeah. Like, the owner of the restaurant, yes. She made, uh, like, she, oh, she was so, sh like, yeah. So, she was kind, too. And she, the doctor, was very close. And then, uh, the doctor was like, please don't do this anymore. He'll die. And then, like, he was about to die. And, but the mean, the mean guy was, like, holding his dog here and was like, huh, let him die. You dare to take my puppy's meat from the ground? Poor man. And then, he was like, oh, I can't eat anymore, Ooh. <laughs> And his servants was like, eat, 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 and shoving rice in his, in his mouth. And it was like, oh, I can't eat him no more. <laughs> and then like, and then like, the dog, and the doctor was like, no, 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 please don't, please don't, and stop it. And then uh, the the shopkeeper, uh, the uh, the restaurant keeper uh, was also like, yeah, don't do this. I'm not going to sell any more rice. And she like she took uh, the rice away and like yeah. And then and then the man and the man was like uh, the one who was saying oh I can't eat anymore. He was like eh, on the ground. And then people were like, is he dead? Is he dead? Oh my God, is he dead? And the you know the rich man with the puppy, he just ran away. He and the servant like. Oh. Ooh, oh my god. And then he was like, like going away with this puppy. And then after that, the doctor knew what to do. And he, he like, uh, like, he like checked him up like his, um, his arm. And then, uh, and then he put like, uh, put it like, nerve, nerve. yeah, he checked his nerves. And then he put it on like a table or something like that. Like, you know, like that. And then he called <laughs> <laughs> oh, I can see it. Okay, okay. What did he see? <clears throat> what did he see around? There were people. Yeah, there were people. There were two kids, and one was almost like seven, I think, and one was like five, like that, that old. Like they were small. And then he was like, "Hey, do you have to pee?" And uh, like the doctor was asking them, "Do you have to pee?" And the two kids were like, 
Yeah, because they were like uh, like holding their stomachs and doing like this, this, this. Yeah. Yeah, they were. Didn't you see? Mm. They were like holding their stomachs and doing like oh, this, yeah. this, this. And that's why, um, that's why he was like, do you have to pee? Okay, okay. Pee in that guy's mouth. <laughs> pee in that guy's mouth directly. And then the two kids were like, okay, okay. And he peed, and he peed on and the they, poor man. And they peed. Yeah. <laughs> the and kids. the two kids peed in the guy's mouth, and uh, the guy was like, oh, 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 I'm coming back to life. <laughs> and they was like, oh, yeah, and they, it did like that. And then like, he was like, mm. He was like almost waking up and then uh, the doctor called his kids like uh, he was teaching some kids to like learn how to be a good doctor like him. He was like take him take that guy to my house and he was like but there's peas in his mouth. <laughs> and then the doctor got mad and said like hey these are kids pee. You used to be too right? And they said like it was vitamins. Kids ah. peas. Medicines. Medicines, yes. Kids peas were medicines, so so <laughs> it was so strange. Uh, like yeah, it was so 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 strange. I I like I was like shocked, like what and in the end there was a happy ending. No. Actually we didn't really watch the whole thing because in YouTube like you can't like prolong video and there were 31 seasons and we only watched episodes like older. episodes yeah we and we only watched like seven or eight episodes like that seven eight episodes like yeah so four or five like that and we were like oh yeah, like that so yeah so the reason we actually watch is that uh, it was saturday and like i begged my mom to watch a movie and she was like no and I was like, you promise? And she was like, I don't keep a promise, bro. I'm a witch. Yeah. And like, mm-hmm. And like, she didn't watch movie with me. And I was like, mm -hmm. then just let me watch movie. And she was like, no, it's 11 o'clock, girl, pink. And I was like, tomorrow's Sunday. And she was like, I don't care if it's Sunday. And I got really angry. And I was like, mama, please. Please, please, please watch a movie with me. And she was like, okay, but let's watch a Tibetan movie. And I was like, okay, let's watch a movie. And then she was like, watch a movie from YouTube. And I was like, mm, we can do that. And then she took the phone and like started searching for And she started to watch the YouTube. And she was like, let's watch the laptop. And I was like, fine. And then like, okay, we got the laptop and then we started to watch and it was so funny. And I'm glad that I thought of watching the Tibetan movie. Yeah. So guys, I don't really used to watch Tibetan movies. Uh, I only watch English movies. Like I only, I because I watch it on Netflix, and I don't know if there's Tibetan movies on Netflix. Yeah. So I just watched movies from Netflix like that. But I didn't even knew there was movies on YouTube. Yeah. Yeah. So. If you watch Tibetan movies, the good thing is that you learn much more. Like uh, yesterday when at night when me and my mom were watching uh, Tibetan movies, I didn't even like understand a little. Like I understand, but little. Like it was a little off because we usually don't watch these things. And these are pure Tibetans, pure Tibetan language. Yeah. So yeah. Mm. The more you watch Tibetan movies, the more you learn how to speak fluently in Tibetan. So yeah, watch more Tibetan movies. It doesn't mean you ha don't have to watch English movies. I still watch English movies. I love English movies. I love both movies. So, yeah, pointing fingers isn't good. So, yeah, bye guys. Yes, this is the end of the video. I'll see you guys later. Like, share, subscribe. Bye. Hope you like the food. Okay. Bye. Bye. Nice.
like, share, subscribe. So guys, now it's night time and hope you like this video. Uh, right now we're having dinner. It's pasta and hope you like this video again. And please like, share, subscribe, share it with your friends, ring the bell so you will know when our other videos come up. So guys, bye and love you so much. Subscribe.